Hello everyone. I am Pupul Haikruzam. I teach English for classes 9 and 10. Hello everyone. Welcome to English class. Today in our class, let us read a poem from class 10 English Literature Reader, chapter number 2, Three Years She Grew in Sun and Shower by William Wordsworth. This poem being written by William Wordsworth, we need to know a little bit about him, the poet. William Wordsworth is an English poet. He is more famous for being a nature poet. A nature poet means in his poetry, he usually writes and celebrates the beauty of nature. For us, for us human beings, for us, you know, normal people, common people, nature is the beauty that we see around. The colorful flowers, the beautiful flowers, the birds and the animals, the rivers and the hills. The, these are nature for us, right? But for William Wordsworth, nature, nature is someone, nature is something that he worships. He is considered as a worshipper of nature. For him, for William Wordsworth, nature is like a teacher, nature is like a guardian, nature is like a nurse. So since he considered nature to be, you know, of, of different, of this different characters, of this different qualities, he feels that, you know, in his poetry, he feels and reflects, you know, this thought that nature is a teacher, Na through nature we can learn so many things, nature is a guardian, so nature will protect us, nature is a nurse, so nature will heal us. This kind of thought, this kind of idea is what he reflects in his writings. The poem for us in our textbook, that is chapter number two, Three Years She Grew in Sun and Shower, is also a poem about nature. In our poem, he personifies nature. Personified meaning personification. Let us know the meaning of personification, you know, because since nature has been personified, we need to understand the word personification. Personification is to consider a thing or an object as a person, a non-living thing, an object, okay? To consider, to treat that object or a thing as a person. See, nature. Nature, for example, is, is a thing, you know? It's not, we cannot say that, you know, this is nature. Nature is walking right through the room. We cannot say that, right? But to the point, he considers nature to be a person. So this kind of a, uh, license that we use, this kind of a technique that we use in poem is personification. So he considers nature to be a person in the poem. He treats nature as a mother in this poem. For a child, it is the mother who nurtures and takes care of her, right? So it is our mother who is always there for us. And in the poem, okay, in the poem, she grew, she, there's a mention of a, of a lady there, right? The mention there is of a young girl, Lucy. So for this young girl, Lucy, nature is the mother and nature takes the role of taking care of her. Like how a mother takes care of us, nature takes care of Lucy. Lucy is a young girl whom we find mentioned in other poems of William Wordsworth. Okay, so it is not only in three years she grew in sun and shower that we find the name Lucy, but we find the name in other poems, in five more poems. And this five poems, it, it is considered as a collection of poems. And this collection of poems has been famously named as the Lucy poem. So five poems written about a young girl named Lucy and this collection of poems called the Lucy poems. When I'm talking about Lucy poem, it is worth mentioning and it is worth, you know, remembering for all of you that William Wordsworth, he had a daughter. Daughter was named Catherine, but very unfortunately, Catherine died from polio at the age of three. So the belief is that, so everyone is of the belief is that the poems, the Lucy poems that he has written, it is all about his daughter. So this poem, the very poem that is given to us, the very poem that we're going to read today is more or less about his daughter, Catherine, whom he lost because of polio at the age of three. As the poet personifies nature in the poem, we see her educating and nurturing Lucy to make Lucy a lady of her own. So our poem, 
three years she grew in sun and shower is all about Lucy and how she grows up to be a matured lady through the teachings and educations of nature. And as always, a poetry gi class today, we have to read the poem first. Nata, a quay poem do paduini, aduna poem do aquay mayam, paminasi. This is the poem. Three years she grew in sun and shower. The nature said, a lovelier flower on earth was never sown. This child I to myself will take. She shall be mine and I'll make a lady of my own. Myself will to my darling be both low and impulse, and with me the girl in rock and plain, in earth and heaven, in glad and bower, shall feel an overseeing power to kindle or restrain. She shall be sportive as the fawn that wild with glee across the lawn, or up the mountain springs, and hers shall be the breathing balm, and hers the silence and the calm of mute insensate things. The floating clouds their state shall lend to her, for her the willow bend, nor shall she fail to see, even in the motions of the storm, grace that shall mold the maiden's form by silent sympathy. The stars of midnight shall be there to her, and she shall lean her ear in many a secret place, where the rivulets dance their wayward round, and beauty born of murmuring sound shall pass into her face, and vital feelings of delight shall rear her form to stately height, her virgin bosom swell. Such thoughts to Lucy I will give, while she and I together live here in this happy dell. Thus nature spec the work was done. How soon my Lucy's race was run. She died and left to me this heat, this calm and quiet scene. The memory of what has been and never more will be. So this is the poem. We have just read it together. Poem se paminagre kwa. Poem se paminagre now let us come to the explanation. Kwa kwe parasi kang minarasi paminagre na parasi mo understand to ba madi matau tari kwa. Coming back to the first line. Poem se pare. First line se pare si. Three years she grew in sun and shower hai. First line se da kwa. Chahi ahum she. Lucy ni hare na cha. Nupi ma cha se na chahi ahum sun and shower. Nung ju nung sa gi marak ta ma se chaura e hai. Kwa. Chahi ahum pun si rame, Lucy se, Prithivi se da. Kwa, Taibang paan se da ma se, Chahi ahum pun si rame, Kari ga loi na na, Elements of nature, Sun and shower do, Elements of nature do, Adu bu receive tau du na, Nung ju nung sa marak ta ma se kwa, Akwe miyo eba mayam na, Hing ni ba se Taibang paan da, Asigum na, Lucy ma su hinga me, Chahi kya hinga me, Chahi ahum hinga me ba kwa. Chahi ahum hinga me, Chahi ahum hinga me ma se Taibang paan se da, Nature na ma si ubo matam da kwa. Nupi ma cha mo oi na ma na tabang paan si da. Nung ju nung sa enjoy ta rakan da elements of nature si bu enjoy ta raga laiba matam si da. Nature si na ma si ure kwa. Ubo matam da kayari hari e. Then nature said, a lovelier flower on earth was never sown. Kwa ma si ubo matam da nature si na kayari hari e. Asi kung ba flower, asi kung ba nupi ma cha si di na. Earth si da tabang paan si da never sown hai. Sown to ba di plant of the so sown koi pambi tha ba. Pocay thabu do ni da na kwa. Ado na flower ba. Ma gumba flower. Ma gumba phaza ba. Nupi ma cha amata. Taibang paan na sada prithibi sada pukla dri. Ma gumba amata lay dri na hai buko. Ado na nature na Lucy se. Ma ha gini na hek hoba matam da khan graba ni ba. Hek hoba matam da nature se na. Sige nupi ma cha sa di ay gi oira da ba ni ay na ma se. Nau kula da ba ni hai na khan gre. Kwa. Ado na nau kula da ba ni hai na khan graba na ma na Lucy se uba matam da lovely flower na hai gre. Kwa. Laya ma ga ma na ne chang dam na gre ba. Lai du ga chang dam na graba na ma na kari hai re. Lucy gung ba lai di ay gi tampak thak sa da earth sa da kwa. Prithivi sa da taipang paan sa da. Ma gung ba lai amadi saat la dri. Ma gung ba nupi ma cha amadi pook la dri na ma na hai re kwa. This child I to myself will take. Ado na mana kari hai. Ma gumba nupi ma cha ama amata pok ladri. Ma gumba lai ama umukta saat ladri. Ado na asuk yam na phaza ba lovely oiba lai se. Asi gumba nupi ma cha se. I will take. Ay na loksa lani na mana hai rekwa. Ay na loksa lani. Mana ay na mabu adopta rani. Ay gini hai na thamani. Mabu ay na nauko lani na mana hai rekwa. She shall be mine and I'll make a lady of my own. Ma se ay na loksa lani. Ay na nauko lani. Nauko lakanda mana ay gini hai. Mangonda, 
ayu eba magun mayam ama kui gi mama mana macha yo pa matamda mama du gi mami macha da tai har ni ko mama du gi oiriba qualities and characters mayam se macha da happy rivene ba takpi tam bi ge do rivene aduna nature ma se kui gi poet se na personify to gre kana ni hai na personify to gre mother ni ima ni hai na personify to gre ima ni hai na personify to bi riba nature ma da aduna lucy se lok se lakanda ma bu i di now kun bi dawrim ne ko ma bu yopi ge dawrim ni educate to dani man hare i take the responsibility of taking care of lucy man hai ko a responsibility ai loina mak lorage ai dai ta lorage lucy se ai on the piro ai gi oirage ma bu lady of my own ha dai sa bi mapung pharak pa ko a perfect lady matured oira pa do hoje ti child ni angang oiri bani dana angang oiri ba ma se ai na lok sala kan da ma ngon ta tak pi tam bi ra kan da magun maya ma ma ha pa kan da ko ma se lady of my own nature gi oiba ma cha nature gi aba mature lady apa ba magun maya ma ma nature gi aba magun maya ma ma yaur ba nupi ama ai na se mage na ma na hai jare ba kana na no hai ri se personify tor ba nature do ma na hai ri myself will to my darling be but low and impulse hai ma na ko ana myself ai isa se nature ai isa se 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 na my darling nupi macha se ma di ma na special oi na lokson jagra bani ko aduna ai ke icha nupi ai ge nuksi jabi se ma si bu ai na lokson lakan da ai se na ma gi low and impulse oi re ge hai ma gi ko low hai de koi gi guiding force hai impulse hai ga na the inspiring force hai re low hai ga de koi na khang ba matam de sin simple term da what is right what is wrong ko som da chat pe ai som da chat pe ya de adu mayam da ni na cha adu ga mu ma na nga sa gi impulse hai ga na koi gi emotion sai inner feelings mayam do inspiring oi ba ko adu mayam se mangon da magun makhan makhan ni characters makhan makhan ni ko ma na instill taw do se hap ka do ri se adu na ai isa sa na nature da yori ba achum aran apha phata phaja ba ati ba mayam pum na mak se sibu ai na lucy da happy ga ni lucy da ai na takpi tam bi ga ni and i'll be ha guiding and inspiring force hare ko and with me the girl in rock and plain in earth and heaven in glad and bower i got and with me and i na mangon da magun mayam se happy rani na ta magun mayam se happy rani na ma ai gi manak ta loina ra ga le ni ai gi manak ta loina ra le ga ibani se loina ra kan da ko nature ga lucy ga se loina ra kan da tungan tungan ba ko situations me am ma nature gi oi ba tungan tungan ba sak saklon maya mama nature gi aba tongan tongan ba mapham mayam da ne mabani se loina raga lai ga ni hai mana kari kari pira me se da rock and plain earth and heaven ko glad and bower na mana pire na tra rock hai de koi direct translation din ni nung jao hai bani mana hai ni se kem tanate difficult oi ba ko awang ba ka ba ani akut atong nai ba plain har ga di kai na i pak pak pa ihang hang ba ko chat pa da ga wa da ba mapham na tra Earth and heaven, ani susu tay bang pan, ani susu tongan tongan bani earth ni, ako yung prithvi pambak silma lairi na cha. Heaven hay gan na shwarga sky, matag tak lairi bak ni hay na kanari bado na cha. Ado na ani si kena bama pam lairi versing in glad and bower. Ko glad hay gan di open space ni hay, ako yung lamhang yam na pasaba, chatok chasin gan yam na nungay bak. Bower hay gan naman na shady place ay ni uga yam hausen bak, isok isok pa mapam. Ko ado gan bama pam different situation ni man na pili si rock and plain. Earth and heaven, nata glad and bower. Tungan tungan ba sigum ba mapam mayam amas si dana ay galusi galoy na raga lai gani hay ba ko? Para tambi do ni mana lusi si dana. Lusi si para tambi do ni educate do ni nurture do do ni ba ko? Mabu yopi ba matam, mabu sembi sabi ba matam si dana. How to face the different situations of life hay ba tare mana ko? Tungan tungan ba issues mayam mas situations mayam mas lag ba do? How to face it? Kamay na mayok na gani? Adubo kamay na deal tau gani? Habas eh nature si na tambido niya ba? Nature si na tambido ba? Karam na tambido na mabani loy na rakanda with me hay do mabani loy na na chat min narani loy na raga chat min narakanda mana na? Sigum ba para mayam si tambido niya ba face to ba mayam si ko? Shall feel an overseeing power. To kindle or restrain, hey man, ako. Ado na with me. Masaya nupi machas na ay galoy na raga lai ni. Ay galoy na raga lai. Rakanda different situations si bu mayok na raga chat pa, cross to raga chat pa. Nata si mam si bu face over si tambido niya ba. Tambido si man ako na shall feel an overseeing power, hey. Overseeing power, hey, bati ko. The governing power of nature, hey, bati ko. Nature si da ako na mangon da lai ba power, magi shakti, magi thau na da. Hadi nature si karino, hey, bati man ako loy na magsibu yeng sinbiri ba ni ba nature si na. Koy loy na magse magi matang at ni ling liba uwa ko sit liba nung sit na cha. Ucheksi mayam sa loy na mag na nature magi 
potok ngata ni bako. Aduna ako na nature magi potok ngata ni na nature mangon dige ako na tamjab ngata ni mangon de yabo power ni ba. Adugi power sa adugumba ng sagi mayam si buloy na magingsen bang ngamba mayam si buloy na magmayok na bang ngamba adugumba magun sa Lucy sa dahapa de ba mano ko. Lucy sa dahapa ni Lucy sa dahapa kanda mano kay doba to kindle hay to inspire or restrain. Restrain to bagi meaning di to check hay ba ni ko. Aduna mano hay Lucy sa dahapa na si gumba magun mayam sa dahapa kanda Lucy sa Kau kaidong ni, magi adu gumba, mayam si bu inspire tau bangamba. Kau mayam si dah cumi lali tau riba mayam si hai bangamba adu gumba magun sing do Lucy da mana happy gani hai mabani loina rakanda magi magun sing sa Lucy da su panghan gani ana mana hai. We have just completed the first part of our class. So what have we learned? Let us try to remember. Nature has been personified. She will be mother to Lucy. As a mother, she will be there for Lucy to nurture, to care, and to educate her. Lucy was the most beautiful creation of God, so nature has decided to take her and be, you know, take, uh, give all the responsibilities that uh, a mother is supposed to for her daughter. And with the teachings of her, with the teachings of nature, nature believes that Lucy will grow into a mature lady who in turn will be a source of inspiration for everyone. She'll become a lady who would be able to walk through different situations of life. So this is what we have learned in our class. We shall continue in another class.